This video follows up that mail day video I just did. We're going to test this box of cartridges right here. We just got these in. Here's on the uh, Commodore 64. Do you prefer if I just film off the screen here? I mean, we know we got a lot of, um, it's just a CRT, so you get a lot of um, wavy motion. Or I run it through the Elgato game capture and I record it this way. Post below, do you care? Is there a difference to you? And no, we won't get all that, uh, all the wavy uh, refresh lines with this one. So in this video, we're gonna capture, and we're gonna use the capture card and record it this way. Comment below, which way do you prefer or do you care? Oh, here we go, I saw the intro, Tapper. Well, let's play test it. Fun game. I'm trying to check the color between, uh, yeah, the colors are pretty close to the uh, game capture and then the, uh, The actual CRT here. The colors aren't too far apart. Whoa, too many drinks down that row there. I kind of space these apart a little bit. People are thirsty. I'm not gonna be able to go down and get that tip, am I? But How long is this level for? Did I get that tip? Going for the tip. How much was it? That was a big tip. Oh, cheerleaders. I'm running. I'm running. Oh, there we go. There we go. I had to play for till the cheerleaders. All right, next game. What game should we do next? Testing Qbert. Plus, plus one. Well, I gotta figure out how I'm holding the joystick here. Gotta hold the joysticks in a, you know, at a weird angle. Oh, wrong joystick. Here we go. Yeah, figure, as soon as I got the correct joystick, I got killed. At least we know this cartridge works. This is a pretty good uh, conversion of uh, Qbert. I'm not sure about my joystick though. Let's see, what am I doing here? Wait a minute. On this Commodore version, this joysticks, you still have to do up, down. They didn't um, twist it in this. Okay, you know what? Okay, no, you're not. It actually plays pretty easy. Cuber's a game I never had in my arcade. Uh, what happened? Oh, I'm, 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 I'm trying to press diagonally on the joysticks, but here, you don't do that. All right, next game. Controls are hard in Qbert, unless you've got the arcade machine. Here we go, Pitfall. I feel like I'm looking at the Atari 2600 screen here. Anyone else think that? What joystick am I using? Okay, I had to press F1 to get the game to start. How did I jump? Okay, jump button. Do you think this is much different than the, uh... Oh, it got me before I could jump. Do you think it's much different than the, uh... Atari 2600 screen? Oh, that's, that's not even close to being fair, is it? Whoops. Let's go down here. I 
Because, yeah, it is a little better graphics, but... Okay. But it seems... Maybe I should put them side by side, eh? Huh. Who put that wall there? Alright. Let's go check out the next game. Post in the comments below if you'd like to see me uh, play test these games for longer, shorter. What do you What do you want? I forget how to play this game. You want to see uh, whenever I test a game, just see if it works. Can I? Cry? What happens in here? Nothing happens. What's in that package? I don't know, but I hit the building. What about this underground stuff? I don't know how to play this game. How long should I? Test each game. I mean, some games are better than others. Like, this game's not very good. What is the object? What's going on underground? Why do, why do I stop when I hit the edge of the screen? I got a lot of questions here. The main thing is, next game. Congo Bongo. This is a game I only played in the arcade back in the day. Just a few times. I never... I mean, it was okay. I'd rather put my quarters in uh, like Donkey Kong or other games. How do I, what, what's, what is going on here? It doesn't look good. This doesn't look good for me. I, I know where to go. Let's try this again. It's not this good of a conversion, do you think? Plus, remember the arcade game it used a, uh, a trackball. Did I jump too soon? I just go, just push straight. Can't hide. Why don't we, uh, three lives? That doesn't seem fair. How do I start another game? Oh, I should jump. You go faster if you jump. Okay, I, yeah, okay, got it. Now where'd I go? Wait. There's a little vine there. Okay, I guess I can't go down that vine. That's why I gotta jump over here. So this is kind of like Donkey Kong. Yeah, I go up there and get to the little... Oh, wait, what's happening? This is, now, here we got a frogger situation going on here. I know I don't like this green. What am I supposed to do here? Am I supposed to... See, I can't jump very far. Okay, next game. Nice thing is every cartridge worked okay. I didn't have to clean any of these. figure out which joystick I'm using. So this is always like Moon Patrol. Moon Patrol. Moon Patrol? Oh yeah, I, I hit fire button for some reason, but you gotta push up and fire button and you gotta push up. What's fire button do? Yeah, I'm not very good at this, huh? I'm playing around with the fire button. I see the fire button doesn't do anything. Cool thing is you can push up and then uh, move to the side. Push up and move to the side, push up, move to the side. That's kind of cool, let's reset a little bit. Oh, duck. Oh, I ducked too soon. Where am I gonna put me at? I hope I'm not at the beginning again. Good. Duck, jump, jump, jump. Oh. Okay, there you go. It's a fun game, right? Next game. I had two games in a row that didn't work there. Well, let's let uh, Centipede here play for a minute.
as always, gotta figure out which joystick we're gonna use. How did that hit me? I was like on the bottom row. chance right there oh I didn't see that happening I do have set I do have centipede out in the arcade I got that in the arcade one up which is really bad compared to the real arcade of course did I ever tell you how much I paid for my centipede arcade machine I bought it non-working I don't know if I've told you this before I bought it non-working for $50 <laughs> and then I end up spending a couple hundred more dollars investing on getting it to work. All right, I was trapped. Trash man, okay, that one worked. Wizard of War still doesn't want to work. And I gotta try to clean that off some more. Too bad, because that's probably the one that's worth the most money in this whole group. Did anyone else get the feeling that this would be like, uh, that this would be like, uh, Pac-Man? What's fire button doing? Nothing. Those guys are moving a lot faster than me, aren't they? I have no idea how long they stay blue for. We're not gonna risk it. Yeah, that wasn't a good move. Oh, in the middle there, that's the city dump right there. Do I need to take my trash back to the city dump? I doubt it. No. I feel like I was trapped there. Game over. Oh, that's too bad. Let's just play the game one more time. Wow, we didn't even talk about the, uh, the sound effects yet. This time, I'm trying to clear off some of that top screen up there. Can I go in the dump? Nope, I could not go into the dump. I, I pressed down, I tried. Oh, that, I didn't even notice that right now there's a top and bottom uh, escape path. Okay, that's nice. Nice to know. Let's see if we can group some of these guys up here. That, oh, there was something in the middle there. But maybe it was a big bag of garbage. Whoops. That guy already came out pretty fast. Anybody else want to know if there's uh, two different screens? Let's just try to clear the screen and go see if the second screen's the same. Because I do not know. So I just try to kill these guys too. Yeah, sure, why not? All right, let's see. Memorize the screen. Screen number two is the same. All right, next game. All right, this is Glaxing. This is why you don't buy cartridges from se from someone that doesn't test this stuff first. Let me take the rest. Let me test it. I have fun testing the games and trying to get them to work. 
Radar Rat Race. This game is pretty fun. So, Galaxian and I went to clean more. Where am I? Wow. I'm trying to look at the map. Oh. This seems more choppy. I don't remember this game being so choppy. What is that red? I figured it killed me. All right. Does anybody like this game? I imagine some people out there really like this game. Comment below. There's that flag. Look, if we go straight up, there's another flag. Uh, I couldn't control the guy. All right, next game. Okay, fire buttons did not start this game. Space. Here we go. Now I'm on the joystick. What's happening? What is that thing there in the middle? Dancing around. What is this? What is that? How do you open these things? I don't know. You guys, what do you think about this game? I don't know. Comment below. And let's go see if... I gotta go see if I can get a Wizard of War and Galaxian to work. If I didn't, this is the end of the video. Let's go find out. Well, as you see, Galaxian is not working. Wizard of War is not going to make it in this video. I'm going to have to take it apart and really try to clean it really hard. Wrong joystick. This was a pretty decent arcade uh, translation? Conversion? What do you think? Yeah, I think so. Really disappointed about that uh, Wizard of War cartridge. It does have a screw in the back side, so I don't have to destroy the label to open it. But sometimes they have to screw, and they're like still glued shut. Or does have to pry it open? Because we need to get in there and clean it with some deoxidant, and maybe something really abrasive. Oh, did I just die? I died. Which this was like Phoenix, where you could like hit your shield. Now, oh, I guess I cleared that level. All right, comment below. Do you like any of those games? Uh, well, I do have Wizard of War though. It was, even though it sucks that this one didn't work, it is in my other video where uh, with the magic voice, and I play it for a good bit. I need to get that video posted. I thought it was pretty interesting. That magic voice. The, why isn't there more games made for the magic voice? That was really pretty cool. Yeah, core. We have Wizard of War that worked with it. And then uh, the ABC cartridge, which nobody really. Yeah, I don't know if you have it or not, but it's, uh, it's not. It's, it's kind of educational, but it's not very good. Anyways, thanks for watching.